here that says Charles Corsi. Yeah, 1891 to 1892. Six months, yeah. baby. Charles M. Corsi. Yeah. And then what about the... For several generations, the Corsi family farmed 140 acres of land, which eventually became a good portion of what we know today as Lansdowne. Their farm consisted of an 88-acre tract and a 52-acre tract, which were divided by the B&O Railroad tracks. Charles W. Hull purchased the 52-acre portion of the farm in 1890 and divided the land into residential lots. The 88-acre portion of the farm, where today Walmart and the Royal Farm Store now stand, remained farmland until the 1940s when Wessinghouse purchased the old Corsi farm to build an ordnance plant. In the early 1940s, Wessinghouse moved the Corsi family cemetery to its current location, which is behind this stone wall. The descendants of the Corsi family maintained the cemetery until sometime in the 1960s, when the cemetery fell into an era of neglect. In 1990, Harold Oliver, president of the Lansdowne Historical Society, rediscovered the cemetery and volunteers spent two years rehabilitating the Corsi family cemetery. The cemetery had become so overgrown with weeds that every volunteer caught poison ivy and had to go to the hospital. Today, the cemetery is well maintained but mostly goes unnoticed, despite standing between the bustling parking lots of the Royal Farm Store and the Walmart Shopping Center.